this is Kenny from Resin Power. Today, I would like to introduce the production process of the lithium-ion phosphate battery cells and how to control the key indicator of the quality. There are three main type cells in the market of the lipid for battery cells, cylindrical cells, prismatic cells, and patch cells. Although the cell design is different, the manufacturing process is more or less similar. Lipid for battery cells are with four main components, two electrodes. One anode holds the lithium-ion when charged and one cathode holds the lithium ion when discharged. A separator that's placed between the electrodes to prevent the contacting and the shorting. And the electrolyte medium that enables the movement of the lithium ion between the electrodes. Let's use the prismatic cells as an example to introduce in details. The first process is the batching and the mixing. The positive electrode slurry configuration is a mixing process in which positive active materials, conductive agents, Spiders and other materials are mixed together. The negative electrode slurry configuration is the same. Missing is to highly disperse the cell active materials and auxiliary materials in a solvent to form a Newtonian high viscosity flow, and then fully mix and evenly disperse the active materials, conductive agents, spiders, and other additives. In the mixing process, the control points such as the material tinnate which must meet the requirements, check whether the speed and the tide meet the requirements of the tachometer and the timer of the mixer, check whether the slurry of the temperature controller of the mixer, whether the temperature meets the process requirements. The second process is coating and the driving. The coating process is to apply the slurry to the current collector. For example, the positive electrode current collector is the aluminate foil. And the driving is to remove all the solvent in the slurry. Key point of the process control is ensure the consistency of the coating as much as possible and pay attention to the change of slurry viscosity and coating speed during operation. The driving temperature and the driving tight must meet the requirements so as to avoid affecting the oxidation of the aluminate foil. Visually inspect the appearance of the coated electrodes and it's required that there are no bubbles, stress and sticky rollers. The coating and the driving must meet the requirements of the thickness, size and weight. The third process is rolling and the cutting. After calendaring, only one hand, it can increase the specific capacity of the electrode so that the active materials, conductive agents and current connectors can be fully contacted which is conducive to the full plate of the electrochemical performance of the active materials. On the other hand, after rolling, the strength of the electrodes is improved and the smoothness is increased, which is conducive to the subsequent process and reduces loss. The control point of the process, the rolling should pay attention to the thickness to meet the requirements, pay attention to the air bubbles, deformation, etc. And the electrode cutting size and the specification should meet the process requirements, no material draw and no waste. The fourth process is winding and shelling. Put in the order of the positive electrode shape, diaphragm, negative electrode shape and the diaphragm from the top to the bottom and make the battery cells by the winding. Depending on the type of the cell, two basic cells assembly are generally used, stacking and winding. And the entire process is usually carried out on a fully automatic equipment. After winding, the assembly cell structure is connected to the terminal or the cell text by the laser welding machine. And the sub-assembly is then inserted into the cell's mental housing for sealing and leaving an opening hole for the injection of the electrolyte. The key point of the process control is the number of the electrode, spacing size and appearance makes the requirements. So do the text and require no welding breakage. Mucus membrane and overwelding phenomenon require no deformation of the case cover and test whether the cell is short circuit before entering the case. The fifth process is the drying and electrolyte injection. The process is carried out in the drying room because the moisture will cause the electrolyte to decompose and release the toxic gases. The materials of the electrolyte is the lithium has a fluorophosphate. The main process to control the quality, the most important is to control the moisture and ensure the weight of the electrolyte. 
The last main process is the formation and the grading. Formation refers to the electrochemical process in which the positive and the negative active materials of the lithium cells are activated by giving a certain current after cells assemble. And finally, the cell has the ability to discharge. The factors affect the formation is including the SOC, formation current, aging time, and the temperature, etc. During this process, lithium ions intercalate into the crystallized structure of the graphite on the anode side, forming a protective layer called solid electrolyte interface between the electrolyte and the electrode. These protective fields result in a low self-discharge rate of the lithium battery cells, which is also affect the battery performance and the lifespan. The capacity grading is to charge and discharge a complex cell, and the charge and discharge current of different cells is slightly different. So as to distinguish the cell capacity, constant charge current radio, discharge voltage platform, and the internal resistance, etc., and spring out the same indicators, the cells can be grouped. So only those with the same performance can be matched to a battery pack. The process is carried out by the fully automatic chemical composition and the capacity equipment. So the control point is mainly to check whether the cell formation and the grading meets the process requirements from the text computer or the text cabinet. What we introduced above are the main process of producing a lithium ion phosphate battery cells. Of course, other texts such as the past text, internal resistance measurement, OCT text, and optical inspection Leakage text will be also involved. The sales production lines are all automatic, including the production and the text records are also automatically to start in the computer, which is available and convenient for the future query and analyze. Finally, these ready cells are to assemble the battery pack from the 12 volt to the 48 volt or the high voltage battery bank. Welcome to visit our website to know more battery pack series. See you next time. Bye.